So guys, welcome back to my channel and today I have here a special guest here with me, Ricardo, guys. Hi. So, Ricardo, uh, you are here in New Zealand, living here for a while and uh, first, of, first of all, introduce yourself. Tell me a little bit about you, where you're from, tell me a little bit. I'm Ricardo, I'm from Brazil, I'm here to New Zealand to do an exchange and to try to improve my English uh, or learn English, yeah. Okay, so you are here to study and uh, how long have you been here? Oh, I'm here for three months. Three months yeah. and uh, since you got here, did you notice like your English is improving in this period of time? Oh, of course, of course. Oh, I improve a lot, I, I think. Uh, when I arrived here, my English is not so good. Like uh, when I arrived here, I think I could uh, have a uh, conversation with you, like uh, we are having now. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, actually, I have uh, an experience before in December when I arrived here. I was here for three weeks, and I went in a barbecue with some Brazilians and some Kiwis and there I couldn't speak with them because I couldn't understand, I couldn't to, to, to talk very well with them and uh, yesterday I had a lo uh, another barbecue only with uh, foreigners not uh, only Kiwis Kiwis, uh, Russian guy and uh, another country, I don't remember but uh, I could uh, talk to them, and uh, for me, <laughs> I was proud because I don't know how, how to explain, but uh, it was amazing for me. Yeah, I think the feeling when you talk in other language and you can connect with people, you know, it's really good. Yeah, yeah. I remember my first time then uh, when I talked with a native speaker on Cambly. It was like amazing experience. Like uh, my I, my English was terrible, but uh, the feeling was good. You know, yeah, I felt oh yes, good. Yes. And uh, because we are improving, you know, we know that our English is not perfect. But when you see that you are improving, it's something. It's it's, it's really nice. You know, I yeah, think yeah. you think it, I, as you say, like you are proud of your improvement. Yeah, yeah you are your English is better now, and uh, you. you have you been like uh, uh, taking like classes, yeah. cl English classes? Yes, yes. So for three months, I yeah, since I, I arrived here, I'm having English class. And uh, do you think uh, like uh, the English classes are is important for uh, your you know improvement or no? You think you, it's better just to talk with people in the streets, you know, what, uh, what do you think it was more important for your improvement? Uh, of course, for me, was living with a, a Kiwi guy. Mm -hmm. I lived with him for two months and uh, I could improve, uh, especially my listen. But I think the, the class is important because you can uh, improve your voc voc vocabulary. With, uh, in the class, uh, in the school, you can speak with uh, another, another guys, another friends, and they can uh, help you with uh, some vocabularies, with some sentences, and I think it uh, can help you as well. Uh, even the class, I, I, for, for me, it's important to, to have a class here, but maybe to talk to another person or to have experience with the other person, it, it's it's the the most important for me. And uh, how about Auckland? Do you f tell me like three things that you like here in Auckland. Oh, three things: nature, yeah. um, nature, I, the people here. I like the people here. I like the activities here. Here in Auckland, have a lot of activities to to do. Especially in summer, I just uh, had summer here, so mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Maybe beach. I like 
beach. I I I like the the, the beach here. Mm -hmm. That I think that's it. Yeah. And uh, uh, since that you got here, did you had like a cultural shock, like something? Oh my God! I can't believe that this happened in New Zealand. That is different from Brazil. That you have never seen before. Uh, yes, and, and you know. <laughs> yes, and know. Ah, yeah. It's not too different here. The, the with the Brazil. Maybe here, uh, the the most thing that is different is the because here it's much more safe than Brazil. But we have some 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 things that happen here with some. Natural people, not natural. Uh, native. Yeah, na native peop native people. That sometimes I don't know, but stole the the stores. Something is strange, but yeah, it's for for me it's uh, strange. Yeah, what happened here, guys? We have like uh, kiwis. Uh, usually, kiwis are people that live here. But we also have the Maori people, Maori, yeah. and they have some rights here that is totally different, and like they can do, a, like they can, like steal a, a, a store and uh, they won't have problems. It's complicated. It's a complicated situation. Yeah, I yeah. think nobody knows exactly why this happened. Yeah. But some, I don't know. My teacher told me like it's because the most part of the policemen are Maoris. Yeah. So nothing happens, but we don't know. But it's something strange because sometimes we are in the market, you know, supermarket, and you see some guys like steal the food, yeah. and uh, nothing happened. You know, yeah, they, they just only robbed and nothing happened. Nothing happened. Yeah. Like they are not hiding. You know, they just take the food, uh, and <laughs> and they leave the the store. You know, or, simple like that. Or, or take the bus without paying. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They just enter in the bus, they don't need the car to yeah. pay anything. And this is common, you know. Uh, yeah. For me, in the, fir the first time it was like strange. Yeah, for but me now as well. I'm now. Oh, okay, just move. I'm used to see this kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now we get used with the, this situation. So, for now, uh, and uh, how long you you be here? Six months? How, how, how many months do you have? Oh, I, I have. A... A student visa for six months, so I have more two months in class, English class, and one month for holiday. Okay. Yeah. Okay, three months. And uh, what are your plans to do now? You want to visit some place, or I don't know, uh, like a, a museum that you like, a place. What are your plans? Oh, here I I, I want to to meet to to know another place. Maybe in the South Island. Okay. Yeah. And uh, yeah, my first plane is that it, it's that I want to to try some company to to get the work visa mm -hmm. and maybe to stay here for more time, maybe two or three or I don't know how many yeah, how, yeah. how much time more. Uh, that's my plan for now. Okay, so you want to extend your visa? You want to live here? Yeah, I, I want to to live here for um, some time. Uh, how can it? Uh, maybe two or three years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's my initial plan. Yes, it, it, this is because of your English. You want to improve your English, or because I know I don't know. You want to save money to do something in Brazil. Mm. Yeah, both. I want to to come back to Brazil with uh, a most perfect English. Mm -hmm. I want to 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 come back to Brazil, and if some people ask me, "Oh, can you speak in English?" and uh, I answer with the whole confidence, "Yes, I can speak in English. I can keep a conversation. I can do anything with my English." and uh, to 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 make some money, saving money, and to come back to Brazil to 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 do some things, to construction a house or I don't know. Okay, 
So guys, that's it. Uh, Ricardo, you want to say something to the audience, some advice that people that are learning English, do you have some tips that help you or something like that? I have one tip because uh, I study English for maybe more than one, one year in Brazil. And in Brazil, I, could, I couldn't learn it because I was not a, a good student. I just had a class and before I never studied nothing. So the, the, the first advice is, is even uh, you are in Brazil, study English a lot uh, in your class, if you have class, or in Cambly, uh, like Paulo, or uh, watch movie in English, try to, to find some words that you don't know, try some sentence, some slangs, try to... I, I think in Brazil you, you, you can uh, learn English. Maybe it's not so easy, like here, because here you use English during the day, during the week, you use English for everything. But uh, even in Brazil you can, can, can uh, learn English. You just need to, to, to be a hard work, hard student. Yeah, that's true. So guys, that was Ricardo. Ricardo, thank you very much for thank your Paulo. time, okay? It was a pleasure. And uh, you can, you know, return to the channel it's wherever okay. you want, okay? Yeah. Whenever you want. And that's it, guys. I hope that you like the video. Uh, you can ask something in the comments, and that's it. See you next time. See you. Caramba, ficou da hora, ficou da hora. Ficou legal? Achei que ficou bom, mano. Você não sei como que ficou.